All right, just wrapping up the trial of Junior Neely, Jamar Neely rather. He's accused in a 2019 double homicide out of York County. WBTV's Liliana Pearson was in the courtroom this morning, and uh, Liliana, you have an update this afternoon on the defense strategy in this case. I do. So we now know that Jamar Neely is found not guilty by reason of insanity. And Neely has previously been diagnosed with schizophrenia and admits that at the time of those murders, he was not taking his medication and he was hearing voices. So those killings happened in June of 2019, and they happened when the York County Sheriff's Department was responding to a shooting on Rivercrest Road in Rock Hill and found two men dead, 50-year-old Raman Thompson and 55-year-old Timothy Barber. Neely was named a suspect, and when police spotted him driving his car near Red River Road, they gave chase. Shots were exchanged and Neely tried to run away on foot, but he was taken into custody. Today in court, a forensic psychologist went through Neely's multiple mental health examinations, telling the court Neely did not know right from wrong at the time of the murders and was acting on the commands of the voices he was hearing. So right now, Neely is going to be turned over the, to the Department of Mental Health, where he is going to be for treatment. I'm Liliana Pearson, WBTV, on your side.